So the 5G PPP is now at a turning point. We are, we are just finishing phase one, which means that we have completed the first batch of evaluations for our projects. We have selected 19 projects representing altogether 128 million euros of public funding. So it's a considerable effort from the European Commission. But we think that uh, this is going to make a big difference in terms of how we can look forward uh, to the future and prepare a, a set of results in terms of uh, new standards, new technologies, but also having as a result a big impact in terms of how we can look forward to a new generation of mobile networks. So it's, it's a great moment. I mean, it's, a, it's very hot uh, today in the conference, but also it reflects that 5G is a, is a hot topic. Uh, actually, we have uh, many visitors at the conference, a lot of discussions many international guests as well and I think that uh, it shows that uh, it's not only about uh, Europe trying to lead this agenda, it's about a global endeavor. We have many partners, more than 100 partners in this uh, first phase and uh, we are really hoping that all together these projects will uh, work and uh, collaborate so that uh, we will have great results uh, in, in the coming years. You, you may have heard that we are also engaged in some international activities uh, from the 5G PPP. So we recently uh, concluded a, a joint agreement with Japan, uh, which follows the one we did already with uh, South Korea some, some months ago. And we are really now uh, looking forward to an agreement also with, with China and with the United States. So the plan is really to make sure that we, we share from Europe with these leading regions about uh, the technology, but also that we can prepare some uh, policy avenues in terms, for instance, of spectrum. There's a big conference, as you may know, coming up later this year, and we would like to make sure that 5G is on the agenda for the 1919 conference, so that we also there make uh, some progress. And we also want to work together so that we have one global 5G standard. So at the end of the day, it's, uh, it's not only a European initiative, it's a global plan we have with the 5G PPP. Many partners working together, but also the possibility for us to make a difference and, and contribute to this global agenda.